Today we are playing The Sims Medieval. Now, we've had a lot of fun with Pleasant Villa, I will say, and we're really getting close to having all of our heroes. I believe we just have two left, but there are plenty of spaces that we haven't purchased, like the King Ball Court, the Watcher's Pavilion, and I think that there is, yeah, a mill. We're doing pretty good, if I do say so myself. We do have a lovely little lighthouse over here. Uh, I think today we might spend some points on another character, but I also do want do, 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 to up our culture, which I think the Kingbow Court will be very useful in doing that. Although our knowledge is questionable. Would a, would a mill help with any of that? No. What was the other thing? There was one more thing. King Ball. Oh, it was the Watcher Pavilion, right? Where is that? Wait, that also doesn't bring us knowledge. Cool. Who will bring me knowledge? The wizard? Okay. Wizard time. Sold. I already know who our wizard's gonna be. Alrighty, our wizard is going to be a lady. Um, just cause I know who it's gonna be doesn't mean I know what their first name is. But it's going to be a member of the bachelor family. What if we just make it Bella? Is that weird? Because I have a headcanon that Bella Goth is actually, like, witches live a really long time and so they have to, like, fake their disappearance in modern times and go away for, like, 100 or 200 years to live in Magic Town, but back in the day, that probably didn't have to happen. So, like, let's do, like... Uh, I, I was gonna say the word MILF and then I, then I questioned it, but, like, actually, yeah, let's, let's not question that. Let's... Let's go with Milf Bella. This is before, because our, our main person is Lady Raven Dancer Goth. But like, this is before times were weird and she had to pretend she wasn't a witch. I think that that's, that's great, actually. I'm a genius. Um, I do think, and then obviously in my head canon, Bella like stalks her real family because she's struggling to leave them behind. So I'm tempted to give her love's family, but I'm also trying to give her different things. I don't know if I've used scholarly yet. I should probably keep a list, but here I am not keeping one. Maybe, well, no, I think I used entitled too. You know what, we're gonna go with Vain. And eloquent. Um, I do like the idea of giving her cursed. Yeah, I'm gonna give her cursed. Because, like, she sees being magic as a curse. Alright, we want to give her black hair, and then what is suitably wizard? I mean, I love this hair. This is one of my favorite hairs in the game. Uh, um, that is very cute, but I don't think the right vibe. I like this one too. I would like this one if the braid was bigger. Like, I just feel like the braid wimps out and it's upsetting. We got for headgear. That's too foresty, that's too nobly. Ooh, I do like that. Yeah, we're gonna go with that one. I'm just gonna leave the face that she has because this game is hard. <laughs> and I don't need to make it harder on myself. So we're not gonna change what her face looks like. Clothing, however, we are definitely gonna change. So she is vain, so like she is gonna be in a fancier dress. I do like that one. 
Ooh, but I like dead one. Uh, that's too religious-y. Eh. I think the queen wears that. Ooh. Clips with her hair, but cute. Something about that one kind of speaks to me. I think that's just a bit too much for her in her particular role. I do like that, but just not for her. I think we're gonna go with this one. It's like kind of modest, but not really. Like she's kind of hiding. Signature red, obviously. Got a bit gold. Wait. Oh, it's that. I thought it was the. So garish. Okay, um, what if we make this just real dark? Yeah. Okay, and then what's this the color of? Oh, it's just like a general. Yeah, I think that that is, that's the look. So Bella Bachelor has now joined the chat. Let me mark her off. Okay, so our knowledge is better, but our culture sucks. And we can't buy King Ball Court. That's okay, that's okay. Cause now we have a wizard and I love that. So let's pick out our mission for today. So we have one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven. I just looked directly into my sun lamp. Love that for me. Where's my, Where's my D eight? Er. Hold on. So organized. So organized. The most organized human being you'll ever encounter, actually. If you doubt that, you are valid. Four. One, two, three, four. The cutting edge. Okay. What are we doing with this? The sword did not change much since its first since uh oh, is this a blacksmith? Okay, I'm not doing blacksmith. We just did blacksmith. We've done too much blacksmith. So I'm gonna just I know I normally choose this, but I'll roll one more time and we'll see. So two, which would be a rash of rudeness. So we could have Cordelia and the Jacob and Priest or the Peter and, Peter and Priest and Cordelia. Okay, I like that, I like that. We're gonna roll to decide who, either educate or discipline. Discipline, yeah, that seems valid. Okay, so are we gonna do Shepherdess Agnes or are we doing Troubadour Princess? Uh, Agnes, we haven't played with Agnes yet. So just a reminder, Agnes is a member of the Crumplebottom family, and she's a Jacobin shepherdess. So, times have been difficult for shepherdess Agnes lately. Her sermons had been well attended, as always, yet the congregation didn't seem as attentive. Some of the more peasanty of the congregation had been disruptive and chatted or belched during the sermons. Regardless, Agnes intended to care on. Uh, I'm pretty sure she would beat them with her purse. This is Agnes. We all know that that's the behavior that she would be partaking in. So let's pay our taxes because Agnes would never get behind on her taxes. I just really quick wanna... Boop, boop, boop. Can we have walls? Can I have walls? Can I, can I have a wall? Okay, there we go. Thank you, kindly. I'm not gonna lie, she's slightly terrifying, but like in the best way. I do love these stained glass windows. I don't think those have ever been converted either, or that door. Or these walls, I'm just saying, I'm just saying like, that's a vaguely spooky, spooky lady. These windows are incredible. That roof texture, hello. That is cool. The fountain is also cool. Okay, okay. This is my, my daily admiration of things. So she needs to bestow the watcher's blessing. So I 
think she just clicks on somebody to do that. Wait, let's... Oh, because they're going home. I see. I see, peasant. Can I bestow it upon the attendant Noreen? I need the Watcher's Gaze buff? How the heck do I get that? Alright, well let's go give a sermon then. Oh, I can't. Alright, it's 3pm, so let's set it for 6pm. So how do I get the Watcher's Gaze? How do I get the Watcher's Gaze? Reflect on the Watcher? that this has been converted. Okay. We're not happy with how many people there are because we are a solitary scholar. Okay, she's got the buff. I see it. I see it. Now let's go and do some blessing. Wait, watch the blessing, right? Yes, okay. Come on, Aggie. Also, this woman has no chin, and I'm so happy about it, actually. Like, Marwenna, you're amazing. Great. All right, so we can't give the sermon yet. Like, we will, but, like, not this moment. Sure, she can only make gruel because we haven't gone shopping yet. Ooh, has that been converted? That is stunning. Literally screenshotting it because it's stunning. Okay, Agnes, how about you eat your gruel, please and thank you. I think you've got one more hour before you can do the thing. Darlin' Rona, how about you go get to know your congregation? Can we do it yet? There we go. Give the sermon. Yeah, I know that's her job. You want to know how I know that's her job? Because she's right there doing her job game. No, the game is just trying to be helpful. That kid's hair is so cute. Look at it. Urchin Laura. She's adorable. Who was that? Who was that man? Was it this man? That looked like this man. He's the only one with dark hair. I can't turn. Peasant Kieran. Intense. Let's be in. Ew, she farted. Not cute behavior. That was... She ain't even here. Yawning and burping. That is this man here. Fighting. April and Chadwick. Oh, she was the one who did the thing. So, the congregation seemed to like Shepherdess Agnes's sermon, and the church received 254 simoleons in donations. Watcher, help me. All the talking, burping, and farting, and they wander around during a sermon like I don't even exist. I have got to get some of these unruly peasants to behave. May I suggest a brick in your purse? We all know Agnes does love that, so... I should fight fire with fire. I will be rude. I think over politeness, yeah. Okay. You will behave. Those rude peasants have not had their, ch or have had their chance. Time to show them who runs the place. We wasn't doing nothing wrong, was we? Aw, why are you gonna go and ruin our fun? Oh dear, she's gonna beat you. 
like good gravy. All right, and then this man needs to behave as well. Aw, leave off, will ya? I don't think the watcher gives a fig about us farting and belching, Shepherdess Agnes. You're brave. You're very brave. He doesn't look very brave, though. Like, he actually looks terrified. He's like, I'm gonna say this, but I'm scared. And she's like, watch your grant me strength, because I'm going to beat this man. I need a vacation. Okay, so what should she do? Lose her temper and lash out or try to solve the problem? I mean, yeah, that, that, that's... That seems about right. We're gonna lose our temper. Spit furiously on a peasant. Oh my gosh. That's it. I have had it with these peasants and their disruptions. The Watcher will not stand for this behavior. I have got to get these people out of my church. Ah, I can't take it any longer. One of these peasants is gonna get it. Ow, my eyeball. <laughs> Now I feel better, but I still feel dirty. I want to wash the rudeness off of me. Okay, where? You don't have a bathtub, madam. How are you supposed to do such a thing? Like, that looks like a font, right? But like... Okay, we'll examine and we'll see. Can I do it there? I think I need a bath. I think that's what it's telling me without actually telling me, because why would it tell me? Domestic? Do I think she would have a really fancy bathtub? A hundred percent. All her money would go into the bathtub. Is that not what I was supposed to do? Oh, beans. Oh, beans. Use a wash basin. So not a tub, but a, but a wash basin. Do we have one of those? A washing crock. I hope I got all our money back for that. No, we didn't. Whatever. Is this what you mean, Agnes? Rinse away. Yes, okay. I think I saw one of them try to use this thing as a chamber pot. Totally inexcusable. Much better, but their rudeness fills this place like a thick fog. Time to rid this holy place of them. Uh-oh. Shoo the peasants. Ew, and they're smelly. Shoo. Get out. Fine, I don't even want to be in your stupid church. It smells. Yeah, that's it. Leave? Everyone is supposed to be welcome in a church. You're a rude jerk, you know that? Is that everybody? Okay, cool. Now, reflect on the watcher for an hour. I can't take it anymore. These peasants. I must, must seek guidance from the watcher. I pray to the watcher and all of us, provide me with answers. Why do I feel this regret for my actions? Yes, I'm beginning to feel the Watcher's will. It Worms? No, wait, that's not it. I must keep praying. Ah, the Watcher has shown me the way. I must make an example of one of these peasants so that the rest may fall in line. Now, who should I begin with? Designate a victim. I mean, who is Agnes going to go for? I think the dude. I think Kiaren, because, like... He was sassy to us. And I don't think Agnes will let that fly at all. I know you're tired. But first, you must mark Kieranen? Kieranen. I really don't like the way you're looking at me like that. Yeah, you shouldn't. You really, really shouldn't. Okay. 
So what should she do? Oh my gosh. Okay, we rolled a six. We're thankfully not resorting to murder. So, Watcher, please give this uncouth dullard some kind of terrible curse. Wow, Agnes. Thank you, O Watcher. I won't let you down. Okay, so wait. Hold on. Curse the victim. Curse with the Watcher's wrath. I mean, I'm not feeling very wrathful. I am feeling very, very envious of this tree not being in my actual Sims 2 game. What is this feeling? Oh no, I've been cursed! Oh, Watcher, I'm sorry! You're sorry now, but you weren't sorry then. She does need to sleep, so like we are gonna let her do that. But how much time should she give the peasant to absorb the lesson? Two. My message was clear. No wait is necessary. Oh yes, I think I made my message as clear as a dagger in the eye. Agnes, you concern me. What are those? I guess they're just fireplace tools. <laughs> Alright, we'll see her when she wakes up. Alrighty, Agnes is up for the day. She is eating. I think we need to... What do we need to do? Give a sermon. Okay, well... What time is it now? 10? So I'll make it 1 p.m. I also need to convert some people. Alrighty, Huntswoman Felicia is now Jacobin. How many do we need to do? Two. Goatkeeper Norman? Maybe. I mean, he's already here, so like... Feels like... A little cheaty. Okay, well, she can't give her sermon yet. Because we gotta wait. How about you go talk to attended Norel? We will not be funny. We will be... How fair are they? Okay. So, give the sermon. They're behaving. We are gathered here today to point fingers at those among us who are rude and vile. The Watcher will continue to punish those who burp and fart and expel other messes in public. Take pride in cleanliness. Cleanliness is Watcherness. Take heed. Okay, so she's now level two. Cool. Alrighty, the congregation seemed to like her sermon and gave us some donations. Love that. So now we need to demand an apology from the peasants. Apologize, Kiernan. We're sorry, we're sorry, we're sorry. We'll be good, we promise. Yeah, again, brick and purse. You think that this woman would not do that to you? Amazing! Gold level, excellent work. Love that for us. Does that give us enough to buy the king ball court? I think so. It's not a lot of culture, but like, it's a little bit of culture. And now we can play king ball. Which just leaves us with the spy, the mill. Where's the mill? Mill, 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 mill. Where's the mill? Am I passing it? Oh, yeah. The spy and the mill. Not bad. Oh, in the pavilion. Pavilion. Watcher pavilion. So I think we're going to call it for today. We had fun with Agnes, which I love. I do have plans to add our spy, and I have some really good ideas as to who the spy is going to be. I'm not as settled, which is why I haven't added them yet, but I've got some thoughts. 
And yeah, we now have a wizard. So thank you so much for joining me. If you like this video, please give it a like. It really does help. And I'll see you in the next one.